Hello, I am Esteban, owner of Vegas San Martin. We are a family with five generations and have a long tradition in livestock and agriculture. Today, we are going to show you a bit of our daily work in both livestock and cheese making. The breed we have chosen is the Murciano Granadina. For us, it is a very rustic breed that adapts very well to both cold and hot terrains. We have other properties, and we hardly notice the difference. This goat has the advantage of being very easy to handle, especially in terms of reproduction and the quality of the milk, which allows us to export to several countries, from Romania to Iran and Qatar. One of the engineers of the company, along with the property, manages these Murciano Granadina goat farms. We invite you to join us to visit the different lots that we have on the farm and the different management practices that we carry out during a typical workday. We are in the process of teaching the kids to suckle, as we saw before, and we bring them from the kidding pen to show them the buckets. Once they have learned, we move them to the milking parlor, where the animals have milk available. You can see Adrian holding a mahogany colored kid, as the breed comes in two coat colors, mahogany and black, depending on the genetic lines. The breed's rusticity means that it adapts not only to climatic conditions but also to the environmental conditions. It is a breed that covers very well in both favorable and unfavorable seasons and is accustomed to being in the field, maintaining its milk production standards. It adapts well to an intensive system with a diet of a mixture of forage and feed, and we can keep it under 2 kilos per head. The cheese extract has a very favorable percentage of fats and proteins due to its rusticity. We have good milk production without exaggerating the fat and protein content that makes the breed excel in this sense. This cheese is pre-matured for one day at 20 degrees Celsius, then molded, and what we are seeing is the unmolding of this type of cheese. Music. Now we are seeing the flipping of the pressed curds. Another product that we make here in Vega de San Martin, this is a much simpler cheese that does not require pre-maturation, and we need to flip it daily. You have seen the cheeses in the drying room, where they stay for about 3 weeks. Once they have finished drying, they are moved to the ripening cave, where you can see that the natural mold of the cheese has started to form. We leave all our cheeses with natural rinds, without any coverings or coatings. This cheese has been aged for a month, and with the daily flipping that our colleagues do, it is becoming uniform on the surface. In the end, we are very happy to have a wide variety of products. For us, the Murciano Granadina breed is very important, as we have been livestock and agricultural farmers for more than five generations. This breed has given us many satisfactions. 